Good morning, everyone. I'm here with Buck and Simon. Oh, Simon just ran. All right. Simon was there collecting his peanuts. Right? Okay. Buck is at the spot. Simon was just here, too. He just dumped his cup. And it's funny too, because while I was prepping Buck's buckets, I had this bowl on the floor and Simon was about to go in this bowl and grab Buck's peanuts. I was like, no, no. I was like, you have, oh, Red, hi, pretty boy. Guys, look who showed up. Red the Carnival's here. Hi, Red. Hi, pretty boy. I threw the seed of bread already. I threw a handful of corn too, because I know the squirrels like the corn. So everybody has their food and fresh water. I put fresh cold water in the little one's bowls and in Buck's bowl. Let me switch my hand. Okay, I had to switch to my other hand. Oh, you're dropping peanuts, boy. You're dropping your peanuts. Just put it back in your bowl. Because you were dropping peanuts. Oh, let me zoom in. Because look who came back. Hold on. See, he has a whole cup of full of peanuts just for him, all to himself. Oh, and there's a mosquito trying to come by me. All right, let me unzoom. I'm sorry, guys. I was trying to show you Simon. Maybe I should stop putting Simon's peanuts like right next to me, like over here, because it'll be easier for me to like zoom in, you know? I mean, it'll be easier for me to get him on camera because he'll be right next to me. I gotta do that tomorrow morning. I'm gonna put him next to me, not behind me. Because it's hard to get him when he's behind me. Because then I have to zoom in all the way, you know? Simon just went home to drop off the peanuts. He'll be back again quick. And Buck was at the spot this morning waiting. It's funny too because he was about to jump over it looked like. I found him I found him all the way in that corner over there and usually that's where he jumps. I was like, you were about to jump to go look for me. It's like if he was about to go look for me. And Bluey's here. Bluey! All right, just a peanut. Bluey just landed. Well, Bluey brought his whole family because there's like a whole bunch of Blue Jays right now on that tree. Right, Bluey, you brought your whole family? He brought his whole family. Okay. And look who's back. Look who's back. He's eating the peanuts, he's so cute. And now he ran home. Yep, that's what Simon does. He'll collect some peanuts and then he'll run home. All oh, the birds are singing this morning. Or well, screaming. I don't know about singing. <laughs> but those are the blue jays that are screaming like that. Because there's about like three or four blue jays on this tree. And Buck is eating his corn. He has fresh cold water. I put fresh cold water for the little ones' bowls too. So they have like icy cold water. Because I don't know if today's going to be a warm day. I think it is. supposed to be in the 80s so I figured I was like let me put some cold 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 water for him because now that summer is here I put a lot like you know really cold water in the winter he gets like cool water like I don't put ice freezing cold water because his water ends up becoming like iced up red is so cute he just flew away I was about to zoom in on him but he flew away that's why sometimes it's hard to get the birds like you know and look who came back this one came back, collecting more peanuts. 
And he's doing it so fast too, Simon. He's collecting those peanuts so quick because he knows everybody's going to bother him. Right? You know everybody's going to bother you? And he's the only chipmunk that comes so close to me. See how close? Now he's underneath the crate. I'm literally sitting on the crate. Sometimes he does that. He goes like underneath the crate. Like literally right under me. Bluey. You guys should not be fighting for food. It looks like all the blue jays are like fighting with each other for food. Bluey. What happened? There's so many blue jays. I don't even know which one is Bluey. But I'll know because when they come down. Bluey is the only one that comes like really close. Like that would jump really close over here. This one is looking for more peanuts. He just ate all. I mean, he took all the peanuts and he's looking for more. You emptied that cup. You looking for more? Oh, he's so funny. There's no more, baby. I gave you a whole cup. A little small cup. He's looking for more. I can't. Last night, it rained and it was thunder in here. Oh my gosh. The weather was crazy last night. I was thinking about Buck. I was like, oh, my baby. I was like, I hope he's under a good tree. And I hope that tree doesn't, like, you know, the lightning doesn't hit that tree. Like, I always think about stuff like that. Oh, there's Red. Red, you know, I keep trying to get you and you keep flying away. All right. I'm just going to leave the camera on Buck because it's hard to get the birds. It really is. Bluey's only one that could put steady camera on him. Like, he'll stand still for a while. Red is always jumping around. Like now Red is on that tree. Watch, I zoom in, he's gonna fly away. Or maybe not. Red, you're so cute. Yeah, look at you, my pretty boy. You're so cute. And look at Simon under here, trying to pick up like whatever Buck dropped. Buck didn't drop anything, but Simon is looking. I don't have nothing for you, Simon. I don't have nothing for you. He keeps looking up too. I gave you everything already. I should have gave Simon also an apple because I know he likes to eat apples. I'll give it to him this evening for dinner time. I'm going to cut up Simon like little squares, apples, like where he can hold on to it instead of like a big slices. Because the other day I gave Simon one of Buck's apple slices and it was so cute. The apple was like the size of him, the way he was holding it. It was so cute. He's over here right now running around looking for more stuff. You could collect the corn. I threw corn. Oh, he's running home. He just ran home. Oh, there's another chipmunk coming. Yep, there's another chipmunk coming from that way. Which I'm assuming, I'm wondering if that's Alvin. Because like I said, I haven't seen Alvin in a long time. And Alvin used to be the one that used to make sure... Oh, there's another chipmunk here too. And this one is not Simon. This one is not Simon. Baby, I'm sorry. Oh, he's collecting the crumbs. I gotta bring out more peanuts for you guys. I should just bring out like a big cup of peanuts instead of that small cup. So they could all have it, you know? This is not Simon right here. I don't, this is the chipmunk that I think was fighting with Simon yesterday. All the chipmunks are out. I remember in the beginning of spring, I was wondering like when, when I was going to start seeing the chipmunks. Because I didn't start seeing them till almost like the ending of spring. They started all coming out. It's so nice out. It's like sunny, a little breezy. You're still looking for stuff? This is a different chipmunk. I don't think this is Simon. Because Simon knows there's no more peanuts here. Unless this is Simon, he came back. Because I feel like all the animals here are starting to get com comfortable. Like, coming next to me. Except the squirrels. The squirrels are the only ones that won't come, like, right up to me. The chipmunks, they'll walk right up to me. Right? You're so cute. I wish I had more peanuts for you. Up oh, there, Simon. Nope, Simon just came. That's Simon now. Up oh, and Simon just chased the other squirrel out. I mean, the other chipmunk away. 
Uh, I think Simon claimed like the peanuts every morning, claims all the peanuts. And all the blue jays are on the tree right now. Is that you, Bluey? Is that you? I'm assuming this is Bluey because I was just talking to him. Oh, the trees are in the way. Right there. Is that you, Bluey? Are you Bluey? Are you my Bluey? So cute. He's just standing there on the tree. You know, this camera has a really good zoom. Thank God. All right, Alvin just grabbed a piece of bread and ran the, to the left. I just seen a chipmunk grab a piece of bread and then run straight there. So I'm assuming that's Alvin. Because Simon still comes every day. Like, you know, started coming again. The chipmunk that lives on the right. That's how I know what chipmunk is which from who, like, when they run home. That's how I pay attention to them. So Simon always runs to the right side, like straight to the right. Like Simon always runs home like this. So that's how I know it's Simon. No fighting, guys. There's like three, four blue jays on that tree over there. Hopefully they're getting along. I think they're getting along. Can't tell. Buck, you're the only one that you don't have to worry about fighting with your food. Buck is literally spoiled, spoiled to the T. Because he's the only one that doesn't have to worry about fighting for food, you know? Like why any other animals. Now the Blue Jays are grabbing the seeded bread. Oh, there was a fly. It's good that it rained last night. I don't have to water the apple tree that's over there. So that's good. All right, everyone, I gotta get going, stop my day. The baby's sleeping, he's taking a nap right now. My husband's just relaxing before he goes to work. So I figure I'll hang out with my husband a little bit while the baby's sleeping. We could just chit chat and have coffee together. And I will be back later this evening. Dumper did not come this morning, but watch, we'll probably see Dumper around dinner time. I think Dumper now likes only coming for dinner time. But I will be back later this evening with Buck's dinner video. And we'll see who else shows up for dinner. <laughs> we'll see. Out of all the animals, like which ones show up. Usually it gets busy in the morning with all the animals here. They all pop out. Except Dumper. Buck is stretching right now. You're stretching, big boy. Buck's antlers are so big. Now he's eating the corn that I threw for all the little ones. Here's something else, Buck. I'm telling you, he always wants to get the food that I throw for everybody else. So funny, I swear. Yeah, so I will be back later this evening. I hope you all have a great day. And me and Buck and the rest of the crew over here, whoever pops up later, we'll see. We will be back later. Ciao for now.